This video is going to look at one of the phyla animals, namely the arthropods or arthropoda. Um, the arthropods um, share a number of different characteristics. These include a body that's divided into various segments. They will have jointed legs, which is what arthropod means, and they will have a tough, tough exoskeleton. They don't have a skeleton like vertebrates do. There are four classes of arthropod. You have the insects including flies, um, butterflies, beetles, um, ants, etc. We have myriapods, centipedes and millipedes. We have arachnids, spiders, mites, scorpions, etc. And crustaceans, which include shrimp, as well as woodlice and crabs, and etc. You need to know some details about the different class of arthropod. And we'll look at insects first. Insects um, can be identified by the fact that they have um, three body segments. They have a head, a thorax, and an abdomen. In this wasp, it's fairly obvious where the three segments are. Sometimes it's harder to see. Um, insects have wings, or at least some uh, some members of the species have wings, say um, male ants instead of the drone ants. And they have compound eyes and they have a single pair of antennae to sense this environment. The antennae are used to sense chemicals in their environment. The second pair, uh, class of arthropods we're looking at are the myriapods. The myriapods, as I said, include the millipedes and the centipedes. Um, they consist of many segments. So they have a head segment and a tail segment. And then the um, intermediate uh, abdominal segments are all um, virtually identical. Each segment has legs. In the, the central segment has legs, so a one leg percent a segment makes it a centipede, two makes it a millipede. Um, they have simple eyes rather than compound eyes, um, and they have a single pair of antennae. The next type are the um, crustaceans, and the crustaceans um, often contain two segments, a cephalothorax, so a head and ab uh, thorax segment joined together, um, and an abdomen. Um, sometimes in a crab it can be hard to spot the difference between the segments. Um, it's more obvious in a lobster or a prawn. They have five or more pairs of limbs, uh, some of which may be modified into claws. So you can see that this lobster has um, ten limbs, um, two of which are the claws. Um, it has compound eyes and often has two pairs of antenna. Again, not always obvious um, on pictures. So with our exam questions, go with the pictures rather than... Um, your base knowledge. The final class of arthropods are the arachnids. Um, arachnids include spiders, scorpions and um, mites. Um, they have two segments, a cephalothorax and an abdomen. And they have four pairs of legs. Sometimes they have extra appendages like this tarantula does at the front, but they don't count as true legs. Um, instead of compound eyes, they have multiple simple eyes and they uh, generally don't have antennae. Um, many arachnids are poisonous, um, so if you think of a black widow spider or a scorpion, then uh, poison is one of the things that set arachnids apart from many of the other um, species. 